players often complain about not having a good passing angle or the angle being covered by the defender. A careless pass in such a position would end up with a possession loss. However, with the diagonal runs you can create new passing opportunities in which you change the passing angle. There are two key points that you need to watch out for. First one is the angle you create. You want to run diagonally towards either one of the sides away from the potential receiver. That way you get a much wider angle for the pass and it will be harder for the opponent to defend it. The second point is of course the timing of the pass. Most of the times, these diagonal runs are followed by through balls in behind the defensive line, so you need to time to pass perfectly in order not to get caught in offside. Try to power up your pass when your receiver is two steps away from getting on the same level with the defender, that way he won't be offside when the other player hits the ball. Find out more about how to use diagonal runs to create perfect passes in our free lesson on the guide plus. The link is in the description.